It's Jim at Share the River, and we are here on a St. Patrick's Day evening, and we are here with the big shot, uh, Michelle Burke. She is the president of Lake Erie Marine Trade Association. They are the, uh, the folks behind the progressive Cleveland Boat Show that we haven't seen you in a pandemic. It's been, what, two years? It's been two years. Well, we did a hybrid show. 2021, but we are really happy to be back here at the IX Center. And you got the name wrong. It's the Progressive Cleveland Boat Show and Paddle Fest, right? Yeah, nice, nice. We're happy to have you here too, Jim. Uh, we're we're glad to be here. So when you when you mentioned when you mentioned uh, the Paddle Fest and the Paddling Center here, clearly there's a reason that you all provided some focus to paddling. This is your first year of doing this, right? It is our first year of building out this paddling center. And it's really, when I met you, I said, we've got to have a paddling center. Well, there was that, but also the fact that, of course, so many people turned to the outdoors during the pandemic, uh, boating, hiking, biking, but paddling, as many of your audience know. So in uh, Ohio, I believe it went up 48% registered paddle craft. And then of course we know there might be people who have yet to register their paddle craft. So we are very passionate about just getting people on the water. In fact, we founded our own 501c3 called On the Water Ohio, which is the sponsor of this paddling center. And it's very important for me to help people enjoy the water, not only boating, of course it's a boat show and it's all about the boats, but we also want to embrace many ways people enjoy the water, which is why we have a huge fishing center and two different stages running with fishing seminars. But the paddling center is just the, the newest thing. We invested in this enormous pool. Um, Marblehead Marine Construction came in and built this beautiful launch, so it's ADA compatible, help people get into this pool. And then of course, all the wonderful vendors and nonprofits that are here participating in the show. And really important for me was the paddling discovery area. I say a lot of my best ideas come from my own ignorance. I actually would like to buy a kayak and I have nowhere, no idea how to start. I don't know the difference between the $200 kayak and the $2,000 kayak. I don't know what kind of kayak to get if I want a kayak on Lake Erie. So for us, we wanted to have this discovery area on the show so people could come and talk to professionals, ask their questions, and get answers to those things. And again, selfishly for me, I could come out of this knowing what kind of kayak I need to get as well. But we've got some great vendors in here. Um, Hobie, Buckeye Sports brought a ton of Hobies with us. We've got inflatables, paddle north, pop boards, Geigers brought paddle boards, and of course the seminars, the educational seminars on, on water safety, on kayaking, on different water trails that are here in Ohio. Um, the drive behind this paddling center was really to embrace the paddling community into our show, and it's something we plan to continue and expand on year after year. Okay, so if somebody is interested in finding out more about the return of the Progressive Cleveland Boat Show and Paddle Fest Paddling Center and everything that we see here, where are they going to go? They're going to go to clevelandboatshow.com. You get discounted tickets online. And look, I'm going to give a little hint to your audience only. Seriously, I don't share a lot of our coupon codes, but OTWO on the Water Ohio also gives you three dollars off. So clevelandboatshow.com, get your tickets. OTWO gives you three dollars off those tickets. Get them online and come out to the show. We run every day through Sunday at five o'clock. Thank Michelle and uh, uh, welcome back uh, to Real Boat Show. Hold on, we didn't talk about all the other stuff. <laughs> There's a lot of other stuff. There's, There's a lot, lot of other stuff. stuff. Twiggy, the water skiing squirrel, and the main stage. We've got Twig the progressive Twiggy's main stage. You know, we have the killer flamingos coming tomorrow night from Detroit. Tricky Dick and the cover-ups. We've got the Putin Bay lobster bisque. There's a ton going on. Okay, I'll let you go now. So what's the weather going to be like? Let's see. On Saturday, I hear it's going to be rain, so that's going to be busy on Saturday, yeah, I think. Terrible, huh? terrible for people to do anything. Perfect for people to come to a boat show. All right, all right, Michelle. Thanks again for the chat. We'll uh, we'll see you soon. Now get back to work. Well, you got a show to run. <laughs> Thank you.